Hey my G's, hey my G's, hey my G's, ba 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 ba. It's your girl Tim Zozo. Welcome back to my channel. Yes, it's a very cold and rainy morning. Sure, it is bus goat in the free state. Bus, bus goat. Does, but angaan in the oost free state. Eh? Of nie eers in die oos vry staat, die in die vry staat. Dit is bloody goud vir oogend. So, ek het gedink dat ek vir myself hot chocolate maak. As jy het hier kan sien, het dit klaar met melk. Wat warm is. Oeh, ek hou nie van hierdie skin nie. Dat ek dit gegou afspoel. Dit is fucking koud in die vrystaat vir my ochend. Let me switch. I tend to lose my Afrikaans here and there, maar moet nie waar nie. Jy kan nie van my skinnerie, want ek gaan vir jou terug vloek as jy van my skinner. Anyway, my G's, thought I should make myself hot chocolate. It is cold. So, Today I'm having the Woolies Instant Hot Chocolate. So yeah, before I make my hot chocolate, since it's cold, I thought, let me cook. I made soup over the weekend and it's already finished. And because it's cold and I know my man is working from home and my son is going to come, so let the house be warm. This is what I'm making today. I am making beef stew with dombolo baby and veggies. My man is not going to have the beef stew. No meat for him during the week. So what I'm making for him, I'm making his fried rice and stir fry. So yeah, guys, these are my ingredients. So we'll be having sweet corn. This is for me. I'm the only one who eats sweet butternut. That's the stir fry that I'll make. And here are my veggies. I've got my onion there. I've got my um, green peppers, garlic. And the mixed veg is in the kitchen. I'll, I mean, listen to me, in the refrigerator or in the freezer. I'll take it out when I am about to hoi it in the meat. And here is my beef. Ooh. And that's my dombolo that I bought from spa and from now on we are strictly having palm oil I'm strictly cooking with palm oil as of today and there's my hot chocolate so yeah let me make my hot chocolate before I start cooking oh the rice is already there I am about to rinse it shortly so yeah, my G's. Ooh, sorry for the lighting. Don't know why those lights are facing that way when they should be facing this way. Anyway, my G's, let me make my hot chocolate before I start cooking. Enjoy. Oh, welcome to Tim's kitchen. I trust you guys are doing well on this cold, rainy Monday morning. I trust you guys are doing well. I hope you guys can see me clearly. Thank you for adjusting the, the light. That's much better. Hope you guys are doing well on this rainy cold morning. I am doing, I'm doing fantastic. I'm doing fantastic. I'm having two sessions. Comfort, comfort drink for the cold morning. So, I think I advertised this in one of my videos. Yeah, but it's still not uploaded yet. Chicken Peri Peri. I previously bought the Chicken Peri Peri and it's finished. And I topped up on the Six Gun Grill. As I stated, you can call Ita, Ita Belang, on 078 297 
don't know if you guys can see 297-0491 she sells spices also very delicious very delicious so yeah let's support each other let us support each other guys so now that I done with my hot chocolate Ooh. so delicious let me start cooking uh, I'm gonna hook up the meat now then I'm gonna hook up the dombolo then I'm gonna do the butternut then I know I only have the sweet corn stir fry and the veggies for the fried rice. I'll hook that up in a wok once I'm done with this whole mess on the stove. So I told my man, when we move, when we move into our house, he knows the type of kitchen that I want. I want a chef's kitchen. I want a chef's kitchen, you know? Not one stove, not two stoves, more than that. I want the whole shebang, the whole chef's kitchen. And it must be steel, oh, and there must be grillers and the hot plate next to my stoves because I'm going to be grilling, I'm going to be cooking. So my man is like, no, love, I know you. So, I know the type of kitchen you want. Don't worry, you'll get it. I'm like, woohoo! Can't wait. I can't wait for that. So, yeah, my G's, let me get on with the cooking. Now, my dumbbellos, I will hook them up in these old school, baby, old school. And I need to go get myself the bowl, 
because if I had the deep bowl, then I would hoi all the dough in the deep bowl. So these, they work too. They work too. So let me just butter them. I don't know how many. Let me just check. I think one is enough. So, yeah. That's my dominoes. Okay. Let us get our dominoes going. The dominoes are looking. So we're going to let them do their thing whilst we carry on doing our thing too. So yeah. So I've got my non-stick spray. The food that I'm making today, I shame. I do miss moms. I do miss mommy. I miss her very, very much. Like you coat it, also on top. Going into the oven. In the oven. There we go. Now we continue with these. Let me summer make the fried rice um, things, which will be the onion the garlic and the green peppers that's it that's all i'm putting in the fried rice because my man is having it with strictly this and then the other onion is for the stew so yeah my jeans it's coming together it's coming together we'll catch up later
president. We are in media from the U.S. to Japan. I thought that when it comes to sexual preferences, nothing would surprise me. But you, what would your loving husband say about them? Your kids, shareholders. Should I continue? Container, con la coca. Alright my G's, my rice is done and the pumpkin is also done. Just waiting for that water to just finish up. Then uh, we'll put our sugar and butter. My stew is coming along and uh, the dumbbells, I don't want to open them. <laughs> we'll check them when it's almost time. Don't know if you guys can see here. That's how the bread is going. Just like that. So yeah. Show you guys once it's done. But yeah. We are coming alright. We are coming alright. So now, once the rice is done, I'm going to hook up this and so I get it ready for the rice and then I fry the rice there. I'm going to grate some garlic now and then basically I'll be done with the tedious work of my cooking. Then all that is left is to just fry the spinach stir fry and just parboil my um, sweet corn. Because sweet corn doesn't take that long to cook. So yeah, my G's, we are almost there. Well, halfway there. Because <laughs> the stew is still a long way to go. So let me do my pumpkin. I've switched off my rice, my rice is ready. Let me do my pumpkin now. I like my pumpkin sweets. We have to go get butter. Butter is finished. So we're gonna do that now.
just need to react quicker because I lose my vigilance when I'm around here. Yeah. Domenico brought all of your stuff. Impressive amount of shoes for five day holiday. Dumbbellos are out and ready. Once we're done with the dumbbellos, we are coming to this for the fried rice. So this is where the rice is going to come, then I'm going to fry the rice together with this. Let's check on the stew. I switched off the plate by accident. <laughs> so it's starting up again. But we all good. Then I'm going to fry this. Um, cabbage and spinach mix. And my rice is obviously done. Then it's just the sweet corn left to do. It's my palm oil. My garlic is already done and ready. I've closed it because I don't want it to turn green. There's my onion and peppers for my stew. As you guys can see here, the dumbbellos, they are ready. My pumpkin is already done. We're almost there. <laughs> We're almost there. Um, it's now 20, 29 minutes to 1. Offspring is coming out at quarter to 2. So the dad is going to fetch him. Then we quickly go to Woolies. We go get him his pants for school. And we get butter. I'm not sure if he's going to want soup for lunch with uh, toasted bread one thing about my son is that he has food today but he doesn't repeat it again he doesn't do leftover food so yeah i'm probably going to have soup for lunch and then we'll have the stew and dombolo for supper so I'll probably get him a pie when we're at Woolies or those uh, on-the-go meals for kids because he loves those. So, yeah. Let me finish up. Let me finish up. Almost forgot my cheese. My bread is ready. Let us take it out. Let us take it out. I can't wear the the mittens now because I'm wearing a camera and trying to get the bread out. My cameraman is working today, so yeah. This is the bread. Let me close this and then grab this right next to the butter because I'm going to brush up the butter then we bring the bread right here so yeah this is my bread let me brush it quickly with some butter
There we go. Homemade bread. <laughs> Sweet corn is done, stir fry is done, fried rice is done, my baked bread is done, my dombolo is done, my pumpkin is done. Only thing left is the oxtail. Listen to me. <laughs> the beef stew. I'm just waiting for it to soften. It's almost there once it's done. I'm going to add these ingredients. I am done washing the dishes. As you guys can see, it's just this pot left and this one. Then we are done. I shame I had fun today. In terms of kitchen, I had fun. I enjoyed cooking this food. Even though I have a whole lot of work to do. It's okay. At least my family will be fed. But yeah, it's almost time to go fetch the offspring. And it is pouring. Like, pouring. That's why I'm going. I don't think we're going to go to the mall now because of the rain. I can always get the pants tomorrow. But we'll see. But the reason why I'm going so that we can fetch the offspring. I know the father is not going to go out with the umbrella and go and kaulela the poor offspring. So I want to make sure that I do that and he doesn't rain because he is recovering from being sick. So yeah, I'll check you guys when I'm back. Later, geez. The meat is nice and soft. So now I'm going to add these veggies. This is what I'm going to add now. you guys here let's first start with the onion and the peppers oopsie Then my veggies. Oh, the meat is nice and soft. So there we go, guys. Now we wait for the veggies and everything else is done. My G's. My G's. Oh, yeah. We got the pants at the mall. And uh, we are all good. Stopped raining for a minute, so thank goodness. But yeah, it's been a pleasure chilling the day or chilling with you guys for this day. On this cold Monday, it's been an absolute pleasure chilling with you guys. Till we meet again on the next one. After this one, I'll definitely show a clip of the full meal that one will be indulging in. But yeah, my Gs, thank you so much. Thank you so much for allowing me to share this Monday or to spend this Monday with you guys. Till we meet again on the next one. Don't forget to comment on my videos. Don't forget to like my videos. Don't forget to share my videos. Share my videos of Tim's kitchen as it is always an absolute pleasure 
cooking for you guys. And don't forget to subscribe to your girl. Let's grow Tim Zozo's community. Love you, my Gs. Keep safe. Keep warm. Till we meet again on the next one. Love you, my Gs.